Welcome back to another episode of How to Build the Walking Dead Woodbury. Today I will be finishing the last wall that blocks off the main street of Woodbury. So that's the main gate there and then we've got the left wall here. All iron, got some ladders, got golf, all that, which you would have seen in a previous episode. Then got the right wall, that's a bit longer since the car park's there. Got tires and then got the cobblestone wall too high there. So the walls are about five high. And then this is the next wall, the final wall. So I've done a bus between episodes so I can just replicate that in the video. Just so I didn't have to spend ages messing around with how it looks. So this wall, I haven't put any tires in, but I've put the cobblestone walls that are too high and then I've made the iron wall four high because the buses do go higher than the iron wall. Right, so let's get started. So first of all you'll want some wool I guess. So light grey wool, dark grey wool, black wool, um, stone, yeah, stone slabs. Then uh, glass, iron bar. Um, well, I've got buttons and all that and torches, but I'll do that last. Um, and then. I think it's, yeah, quartz floor inside. So I'll get the iron door and quartz um, slabs. Wherever they may be. There we go. So I'll quickly show inside. Oh, if I can get inside. Yeah, so the bus is only four wide, so the seats are a bit awkward. But I just wanted to have the buses so they're quite don't take up too much space really. Then I got steering wheel which is black wool item frame and then compass inside and a lever. So that's that. I'll just keep that door um, there right now like well taken away. Right so the bus is four wide and one two three four pretty much five high at the highest point anyway. And then if you're just counting the wool, the length of the bus is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 13 blocks long. And then, so 14 if you're counting the iron bars. So first of all I'll start off with the front of the bus. So I'll have a little gap. So I'll start there. Then it's four bars, one, two, three, four. So the bars do connect to the wall, which is annoying, but can't do too much about that. Then it's two grey wool on top of them four, and then four along here, because the um, tires, I mean, they're not exactly correctly shaped tires, but there are just two blocks wide on each side. Just easier that way, really. Um, I'll just quickly sleep so it's easier to see. And then I'll continue on the bus. There we go. Right, so next it's. The one with the steering wheel, so block there, block there, and then a black wool block would go there, but I'll put that in later. So rather than having it so you can see underneath the bus, I'm just going to have it so it's placed along like that. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So it goes right along to the edge. So I'll just remove that because that will get in the way. But that's fine. It's going to take up some space anyway. Um, so black wool, I think it's here. Yeah. So that's where the wheels go. So it's 13, 12. So 11, 10 and 11 for the back wheels of the bus and then two and three in the length anyway right so the door goes there so then I'll just do black wool here not black grey there we go and then just pretty much leave the gap there for where the door goes windows they go on the third one where the steering wheel is yeah so I'll just put that in now there there we go I'll just put that all in we'll save time later and then that bit there I'll just put that there right and then that so I think so that's too high for all the grey wool right now and the glass goes all the way around on one side yeah but leaves a gap for the door so Let's remove that one for now and then I'll put it back later if I want. So it's like that. It's four high. Then glass all the way along. Well in in between here. Like that. Yeah, like that. And then grey wool on top like that. I think should be right and then this grey wool that goes there like that and then all the way along so that's fourth layer pretty much done apart from I'll put that in there um, right what next I'll just have a look at the back. I'll put in the back bit now. So it's four iron bars underneath that bit as well. Um, then I'll do the stone on top around this bit here. So all around the grey outline of the bus. Just so it doesn't look like quite a, it, well I want it to be a curved roof rather than just going up very steep and then it's light grey wool here on top there apart from there yeah I think so right just need to check inside does that all work check back of bus I'll just get some nether brick stairs out. Yeah, so there was grey wool there. So I'll put in the slabs now for the floor. So the slabs pretty much go on the well first layer of the bus, but on the top bit of that block all the way along. like so there we go and then it's two nether brick stairs then leave the gap two nether brick stairs leave the gap two nether brick stairs and then I think it's one stair there it might be one yeah it's one closer I think 
There's plenty of space anyway. Shame Crave can't be a bit easier for flying in these blocks. Right, and then all I want is black wool there, I think. So much else inside. Got all the glass. Yeah, it's almost done. Right, so next you'll want um, item frames. Don't need that. Oh, need some signs. Let's get rid of the stairs. Um, what else? A compass for the steering wheel. I need the iron door, so that will be annoying. So I'll just put in the item frames for the wheels. So I'll get rid of that. There we go. And then I need buttons. So this is just stone buttons. Right, so the stone buttons, um, second layer of the bus, leave the two in the middle gap for the buttons there. And then for the front of the bus, it's on the top there, on the fourth layer, like so. And then two signs. Like that. And then, I uh, oh no, need torches. So I'll just get rid of iron bars. So you place the torches in first and then you place the item frames behind it so it looks more like headlights. Yep, so that's front of the bus done. Then it's just back of the bus, which is you just need red and orange wool. So I'll quickly get that. So it's one by two on each side, and then it's red blocks of wool in the top ones, and then orange here. And that's the back of the bus sorted. So now it's just the inside bit, which you need a lever. Like that. I'll just place it like that. Um, then another item frame and a compass inside. And the pig, I think, is staying. So I'll keep that pig in there. If I can get to the door and trap it in time. So that is the bus, well, two buses, ready just to stay there and block the road. And I've done that bit wrong because I need some grey wool, light grey wool. So light grey wool covers that bit as well, just forgot. Yeah, I think that's it. So that was how to build the bus wall. So the final wall of Woodbury, the far away one. Two buses cover it. This is where Oscar dies, I think. And where Rick and some of the gang try and escape by hopping over the wall here. Right, so that's the tutorial of how to build the buses. Hope you enjoyed the video. Remember to like, comment and subscribe to Mr. Appleby Productions. We'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.